I was thinking where I can find this restaurant. I thought it's inside a museum, but it's actually just in this nice garden outside of the museum. It's like one minute away from the museum at the back. And I'll have my lunch now. Off the doors, and he changed the two things for Easter. Oh, what's the special thing about Easter? The second course and the main course. He okay. At this tasting menu, but it's an Easter special. They changed the second course and the main course for the Easter. Okay, I'll just try everything and see how it goes. Ice cream, kinds of butter. Yeah, soy butter. A butter made with uh, ramsey and a butter made with beetles. What's ramsey? Ramsey. It's a herb. Oh, it's a herb. Okay, thank you. And about the, the three kinds of butter, the first one is the soil, the second one is the ice cream, and the third one is the butter. And the butter is very nice. Yeah, 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 the butter is We're having some uh, starter bites to kick off this dinner. This is in lunch. Sorry? This lunch. Yeah. <laughs> We're having a tartlet with onion compote, strained yogurt, and chives. And over here, a uh, cumin waffle with cheese cream. And this one is a uh, uh, olive sponge cake with paprika. Oh, this is sponge cake. Yeah. What's Enjoy. this again? Tartlet with onion compote. Of course, on garden, and an oil for a dill, and a sauce made from buttermilk and horseradish. Is this the special one or is this not? No, this is this is in our normal menu without Easter, but it is in a new menu because we started it not last Tuesday, but the Tuesday the before. How often do you change your menu? Uh, two to three months. This is my second dish. I think the They hide all the cutters in the drawer. I was like, where is my cutters? They all the way down to the bottom. Everything looks very fresh yeah. here. <laughs> Oh, it's super fresh! With green apple and a jar of turnip. Turnip and green And this one is turnip with green apple. You see the green apple on top. It's very unexpected, you thought it's a sweet part, but then actually there's both some meat inside, so it's, it's salty. but. Because there's a layer of the green apple and the turnip, they, they mix it very well. Naturally, just from the salty to the sweet. It's very surprising. Like. So this dish is uh, smoked egg yolk with some vinegar. It smells very special already. I think the theme is all like fresh and green. Same as the city. Mm. Because the cabbage is sweet, and then they have some like vinegar, so it's the right combination of the sour and the sweetness. Just to open up your palate and enjoy the rest of the day, the lunch. And a crumble of flutaka. A crumble of what? Flutaka. With the sesame and seeds. This one looks amazing. So some foam on top. They give you some okay, so it has some scallop too. Scallop and white asparagus. It's very tasty in the way that they have this scallop, very tender taste, and then they have something that's the taste texture of a cracker. So you have the white asparagus, the scallop, and cracker and have a crispy taste. And with the foam. So everything combines very well together. Uh, a mousse of ramson, green asparagus, and yes. It smells very good. See the lamb, they're perfectly grilled. You can see the layer in between. It's super good. This one, this one that you don't, you couldn't really taste that wild, like the very main type of lamb. That you can also pair it together with the seed mousse and the goat yogurt. There's a lot of taste, a lot of layers of taste. Oh, coconut sorbet, fresh strawberries, a jelly of coconut, and the sauce of tomato and pepper. Thank you. This might be 
insert looks like a it's like a head. Coconut sorbet and strawberries. It smells very fresh. When you cut through it, it has so many different layers. And you can see the strawberry and the jelly like inside. This dessert is amazing. Like on top you have a very smooth kind of topping. Sorbet is amazing. a very summer type of dessert. And then you have the strawberry inside. It's just everything is very very fresh and it's, I think it's a good end of the tasting. You see how many layers there are. Thank you.